아직 인류에게 멀고 도달하기 어려운 곳임에 다시 한번 긴장된 순간이 돌아오고 있습니다. Officials in South Korea said a rocket that it sent into space carrying an observation satellite was believed to have exploded in flight. Minister of Education, Science and Technology An Byung Man said officials believe the two-stage narrow rocket operated normally for 137 seconds after liftoff from the country's space center, but then communications with the rocket were lost. Earlier, the head of the space agency, Lee Ju Jin, told reporters they were seeking ways to find the satellite, which was meant to study climate change. 137 seconds after its launch, telemetry and all communications have been lost. The altitude was about 70 kilometers, and the distance was about 87 kilometers at the moment of communication disconnection. Before this point, all data were normal, so we will now seek ways to find the satellite. The rocket launch had already been delayed by one day due to malfunctioning firefighting equipment near the launch pad at the coastal Narrow Space Center. The rocket's launch was North Korea's second from its own territory. In the first attempt last August, the satellite failed to go into orbit because one of its covers had not come off after liftoff. Since 1992, South Korea has launched 11 satellites from overseas sites, all on foreign-made rockets. The narrow rocket's first stage was designed and built by Russia, and the second stage by South Korea.